If you're a radio ham and you've worked FT8, you may be entitled to some awards. If you want to know how to claim them, stay tuned. I'll show you how. Welcome to the Ham Radio Junkie, with me, Keith. Now, I know FT8 isn't everybody's cup of tea, but if you do use it, the chances are you may have already earned some awards and you don't even know it. So let me tell you how to claim them simply. The first thing you need to do is go to this website, and I will leave a link in the description below. Once you're on the website, you need to go and register. And this is very simply done by clicking on this link and filling out these details. To register is absolutely free. And once you've done this, you'll be sent an email with details of your membership. And that's the first stage complete. Now, once you've done this, you need to go to the top on the right hand side and look at the downloads. There is only one piece of software listed here and it's Ultimate AAC. You need to click on that and you'll see various details of what the program offers. Like most radio hams, I'll doubt that you'll read this at all, but if you wish, you can spend time reading. Next thing you do is select which operating system you wish to download, be it for Windows, Mac, or Linux. Within Windows, there are obviously the 64-bit and 32-bit, and for us, we're gonna select the 64-bit. This opens up the download page and we simply click the download. Once it's downloaded, execute the file. And if using Windows you see this, don't worry, it's quite safe to run anyway. As your software installs, you will be prompted to make changes if you so wish, such as language and where you want the file on your hard drive. Once this is complete, you'll be ready to go. By clicking on the desktop icon now, the first thing that will happen is there will be a number of updates and this may take some time, so don't worry about it. It will run and finish and then you're ready to move on. Once the updates are completed, this screen will appear and the first thing you need to do is enter your call sign. This may also add other details that are already attributed to you. As you can see in this example, it's added my full name and also my email address. There's no need to change any of the other settings. By clicking on the number tab, you can enter your membership numbers and if you don't have membership, you can click the join button and this will take you to the page where you can subscribe. Again, all these clubs are free to join and just take a few minutes to subscribe to. Returning to the software, the opening screen shows the various clubs that you may have already subscribed to. And clicking on this tab brings up all the different clubs and you can click on each one to select and then choose which awards you wish to apply for. Now let's look at the program in detail. The first thing that you need to do to verify your awards is to download your ADIF file of your log. This will be found on your FT8 program or your logbook and can be simply uploaded by clicking on either of these tabs and selecting the file. Once you've uploaded your logbook, by clicking on this circle, your logbook will be scrutinized to see how many awards you may qualify for, and this will be done automatically. Moving across, you can see that there are various other tabs which you can take time to explore. One tab of particular interest is this one here, which looks at your awards. You can scroll down and see which awards you've already been awarded and which awards are still outstanding. By changing the club, you can then go and check the different awards for each club. Within each award, you can also click on the plus symbol to see which awards you've achieved within each category.
So that's it. It's that easy to get your awards from all these clubs for working FT8. And when you download them, you can print them off and put them around your wall. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, consider subscribing and hitting that bell. And seeing you've got this far, how about giving us a thumbs up? It lets me know I'm doing something right. So, my name's Keith, my call sign is G0FEA, and I'm the Ham Radio Junkie. I'll catch you next time. <laughs>